What's up guys? It's EB from Kids Play TV and today, like I said in the last video, we are going to be doing the Yummy Nummies Mini Kitchen Magic, but the candy bar maker right there. It looks like it comes with molds in milk chocolate and white chocolate. Hopefully this is some really good chocolate because I love chocolate. I'm sure you guys do too. But let's get this thing open. I'm super excited to make me some candy. So, doo -doo -doo. I untaped it. I didn't look into it yet, but just to make it go a little faster. Okay, so it comes with the mold. I kind of flipped it upside down for you. Um, this is what it looks like normally. But so you guys can see what the chocolate's going to look like. It has a mustache, a peace sign, like that, and it says peace. It has a puppy dog. Uh, hashtag yum with a smiley face and a tongue sticking out uh, I heart you and a bike the bike is a little random I don't know why there's a bike there but there is so that's our molds then comes with the chocolate chips I believe white chocolate is the pink bag and milk chocolate is the purple bag then we have some I don't know what to call it it's like piping bags there you go I found the word for it I think that's a plastic knife back there an orange one and then from the box this these are candy wrappers so I'll try to do the best I can with these I'm sure I'll fail at it but we will see <laughs> and then it comes with the instructions so you choose the chocolate pack it for your, your first candy bar fill one of the melting bags into line three and then fill a bowl with warm water and then melt the chocolate that way and then you put the melted chocolate into the mold then um, fill the rest of the molds and then you put in the refrigerator for five minutes and then you remove the chocolate bars and enjoy right there number six so let's get started Okay guys, so I'm done kind of opening everything, not quite, just the plastic. I got everything out. Um, I think what we're going to do is do both of the chocolates right now and then I'll put them in the warm water and then come back after everything's melted. Um, so let's open up the white chocolate first and get it into the piping bag. I got my trusty scissors right here. So those are the white chocolate chips. And I think it, if I remember right, it said fill to the line three, which is that line right there, if you can see it. That's it. So pretty much they already kind of pre-packaged the chocolates to go to line three, so. I think that's a good thing though. You don't get any extra chocolate. So let's put the white chocolate aside. And then next we're going to pour in the milk chocolate. And that's what those chocolate chips look like. There you are. That one's um, a little over line three, but it's okay. 
Ah, uh, maybe not. Never mind. Gotta, gotta like squiggle them around in there so they fit. So now that I have our piping bags all filled up to the line, what I'm gonna do now is run them over some really hot water so it can go a little faster. Have an adult help you with the, these if you're not old enough, if you're not above six, um, just so you don't burn yourself or hurt yourself or get any water in the chocolate because uh, that would be kind of gross. So I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I'm back after melting the chocolate. This is kind of what it looks like. It kind of is a, it's very hard to melt actually and it kind of hardens pretty fast. So what you want to do is do this pretty quickly. Um, I should probably remelt the, the milk chocolate but I'm going to try it anyways. And if it doesn't ha work very well then I'll go back and try to melt it one more time but it comes with a little um, tear strip at the end. You can't really see it but I don't know if it will work. Oh, it worked a little bit. So, if I can get it all the way off, that would be great. Okay. So I'll make this peace sign right here. It's chocolate. Come on. Ugh, squish it out. Okay, so I got my first one done. I kind of cheated a little bit only because I don't think the water that I used was really hot enough. So, so it really hardened super fast. So it was, like I said, model chocolate consistency. And um, hopefully the white chocolate's a little better, but the milk chocolate like hardens super fast. So yeah, I'm not quite sure. That is probably, probably my own fault, just like the gummies last time was probably my own fault for making them really goopy. With these yummy nummies, I am just not having good luck with them. So I'm gonna try this milk chocolate, or white chocolate. So this one also seems like it's kind of hardened super fast. So I might just, ah, uh, maybe not, maybe not. At the bottom, it's a little easier. Okay, so I got the white chocolate one filled. Again, I kind of cheated only because it was really really hard at the top and I kind of just molded it into here. I'm gonna probably do the same with all the other molds so when if you guys have this I would recommend just letting the chocolate soak for a nice like 10 to 15 minutes in hot water because I was only running it under my faucet and I don't think that it's a good way to do this. So I'm going to fill all of these up and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I'm done with putting the chocolate into the mold. I cleaned everything up and I put them into the refrigerator for about 5 to 10 minutes. I'm going to try to carefully take them out of the molds. Kind of afraid. I don't want to ruin them a little bit. I don't want to ruin them, no. Don't ruin them. Okay, got this one out, the first one. So ready? That is the first one. It's the peace sign. It came out pretty good actually. I mean, cause I had to kind of smush it into the mold. Um, it, the side didn't turn out well, but you know what? It's chocolate. Chocolate is chocolate and chocolate is chocolate. So, It'll all taste the same in the end. So that's the peace sign one. 
This one turned out awesome. A little mustache, a guitar. <laughs> it's a fancy chocolate. Fancy. Look at that. So that is the hashtag yum. That one actually didn't turn out that bad. Okay, so that is the puppy dog. Look at it. It's so cute. Woof, 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 woof. And that one is by far my favorite because I love puppy dogs. But the bike is kind of ruined. It's okay though. It's okay. I'll still eat it. But the I love you kind of got ruined. It's okay though. But our next thing to attempt is going to be putting one in a wrapper. So I'm going to move these over. So, um, trying to figure out how I can do this. I'm gonna do that. So that is my candy ra all wrapped up and it's like a really cool gold color too. Look at it. It is so cute and I'm going to go give this one to Trevor. I hope you guys enjoyed this video even though I did mess up. If you did give this a thumbs up and then you can also go ahead and click subscribe right there. Um, we have a lot of new videos coming up and like I said before, we didn't post videos for a while, so I hope you guys still enjoy our new ones. Um, we did get some the pizza yummy nummies, um, because Trevor dared me to, of course. And then we have some other new toys to show for you. Again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye!